Hey Owen, in this video I'm going to be continuing with Eternal Fury. I'm going to be testing out the arena, continuing with the campaign, and possibly trying out anything else that unlocks as I go. I'm working quite hard to get everything leveled up. Got the buildings up to 21 to match my level. As you can see there. Apart from the two I haven't unlocked yet, the warehouse and the wall. We're working on my text, my academy here. I'll upgrade this a bit more. Here we go, I'm going to be taking on the arena. So I've already done a couple of attempts for this. I'm going to be using up my other 13 attempts. I'm not going to go for anyone too difficult. I mean, there's a 52,000 BR there. I've already got 7,000. So let's start with someone nice and easy, hopefully. Yeah, that was yeah, very easy. Right. Good start. It's another very easy one there. So that looks like the best choice there. There we go, no problems so far. Let's keep pushing my rank up. Oh, another 400-ish BR there. Again, these are all very, very easy by the looks of it. I'm sure this will get harder as my rank goes up. Might as well go for the 996. Should be able to do this. Here we go. Again, rank 830, 270 BR. So I'm pushing my rank up quite far actually from doing this. I mean, look at that. Okay, these are lo looking a little bit tougher. 504 is out of my range. Try the 547. Yeah. There we go, should have got this one. There we go. Alright. We get a very easy one there. Three more attempts to use up. If I press the plus. That's not that expensive actually, but I don't think it's really worth doing. There's only one here that I've really got a chance against, and that's that one here. Nice and easy. All right, let's go for the three, five, four. Have a very easy one. So I've managed to get my rank up to 300 through this. That was pretty easy. There we go. All right. Let's 
get out of here. Why does it make you trying to add a friend? I thought I'd already added someone. Guess I have to apply. Oh, there we go. I thought I'd already done that with my friends list, but clearly not. What else have we got to do? Well, that was very easy. All right, nice rewards there. Chapter five. All right. Okay, so that's for clearing one elite dungeon. I'm not sure how hard the elite dungeons are. So I'm going to give this a go. See how I get on. Yeah, they're not particularly difficult. So I can quite easily continue with this. There we go. Yeah, that wasn't particularly difficult. Ooh. Oh, they shuffle up the cards, right. Um what I have to pay to open? No, I think we thought we will pass on that, should I say? Ooh, the wall crusade. Wants me to upgrade the wall. Okay, so I have to wait until that's under five minutes. Since it's under five minutes, I can speed it up. There we go. I'm not really sure how high I should be upgrading the wall. I'll go and max it out though. All right, so I've upgraded it to 16. I'll now enter. Oh, troops limit, right, I'll put that at the back. So I'm guessing this is sort of like plundering in Warshoon. Your troops defend the city. I'm guessing you lose gold if you get attacked. We'll find out though at some point. We'll click the magnifying glass and search for opponents, right. Poor. Right, so if I click search again, will it give me someone else or... Very poor. BR's quite high though. Rich. Oh. Get the BR on that. Yeah, I think we'll... Right, okay. It's gonna give me a few selections to choose from. We really wanted someone a bit easier. Someone around the 6,000 mark, but I don't think, oh, there we go. Oh, rich. This one could be promising. Thank you. 
He hasn't set any troops either. Taking a beating though. Because that's a BR without any troops for the looks of it. Because she's ripping me to pieces, as you can all see. Because what does that do? That's a shield or something. Oh dear. This didn't exactly go well. Okay, so that wasn't a good idea. It cost me gold to search each time, unfortunately. I'll try and find someone a bit easier, though. Let's just try this one. This area of the game might be a little bit too difficult for me at the current strength I am. Doesn't seem to be anyone particularly diff particularly easy, should I say, not particularly difficult coming up. They're all difficult opponents. Yeah, I've got absolutely no chance, unfortunately. Alright, so I'm going to leave this feature of the game, I think. I'm not strong enough to do this. Alright. Let's do another normal dungeon. Yeah, this isn't too difficult. Look at that, what to out one attack. Pretty good going. There we go. No problems there. Let's see what else I've got to do in the quests. Let's give this a go. I think this is another elite dungeon. Pretty easy. I mean, no problems here. Nice clearance reward there. Oh, we have this again. I think we we'll skip that. So I should be close to making another set now. Here we go. I can make two of those actually, which I think I'm going to do anyway. Probably don't need two. I'll go and enchant one of them. 
As you can already see, I was working on making a level 20 set yesterday. Might as well use luck stones to make it a bit easier. There we go. Oh, it's forcing me to equip it, okay. That's okay. I wanted it equipped. Alright, so what I need to do now, I think, is just continue with the dungeons and try and get stronger. Then maybe I can have another go at the Crusade part attacking other cities. So I'll be doing that now. Once I'm done with that, we get back to the video and I'll continue with any other features that I unlock. All right, so I've just unlocked the socketing feature. It's going to make me socket a gem, I would have thought. Okay. Gems on the same equipment must be unique. Now we have a HP gem, right. So let's put HP gem in. Probably, what is that? That's a, that came up as a HP gem. That's a magic defense gem though. This one's the HP gem. Put that in as well. So I probably wanna put that in. Okay, that's quite expensive. I think we'll just make do with the one socket for now. Especially as this equipment will probably be sold or recycled as it's called in game at some point. That one had two open sockets so the other ones only seem to have one. As you can see. Oh, there we go, another socket there. I think we've filled up all the gem sockets. The other thing that I've managed to do, or about to do, should I say, is promotion. So that does all that. Increases the stats. And a new skill. That's pretty good. My BR's actually going up now. Might as well upgrade these two while I'm here as well. Also got a new one. Got two archers there and that's a mage. So I might end up using the mage since I want something different than just two archers. Alright, so I'm going to level up some more. And see what else unlocks. So here we go with that. Okay, I've just unlocked the bounty board or bounty hall as it's coming up there. Gonna have a look at this now. So this is very similar to War Tune again. You have the quests and they give you EXP and gold. Only problem is I've already used my arena attempts. Kill monsters of specified levels. Oh yeah, I remember that. 10, 20, probably a 30 quest as well. Enchant any equipment. Your VI, what? Okay. We have a problem. I don't have any equipment to enchant, so I can't even do that. Challenge in arena. Let's see if it lets me do that. I'm playing the arena rewards, but I haven't got any attempts left. So I can't do that either. Kill monsters of specified levels. What a thought. I'm able to do that. It's making me go to this mission. We'll try and get this done. At least I've actually completed one of the bounties. So I've done this mission before, shouldn't be any problems for me to complete it. Yeah. 
There you go, wiped him out in one attack there. Nice and easy. So hopefully that's completed the bounty quest. Kill monsters 0 out of 10. So why is it making me go to this mission if that's the wrong mission? That's really strange. I'm not sure if I can even do any of these. I'm going to try the free refresh. Harvest resources. Now surely I can do that one. There we go. I completed it. Kill corres clear corresponding normal don dungeons. Right. What's it going to make me do? Do I just clear any of them? Let's try this one. So the bounty quests are proving to be quite a bit harder than I was expecting. Without any arena attempts left. Can't do that one. I'm going to guess I needed to do a harder dungeon for the kill monsters of a specified level. Alright, we'll blitz through this dungeon at the boss now and see if that's completed the quest or not. this quickly. Nice and easy. Well, again, it's not completed it and I've got to do two dungeons by the looks of it. There's another one that's quite difficult. The refresh time is every 30 minutes. Let's do one free Refresh. Was this a boss or something? Let's give this a go. But yeah, it is a sort of boss. This shouldn't be a problem. Alright, and there we go. only giving me gold and EXP so not massive I put on the harvest resources quest now I'll wait until there's actually resources there and I'll go and collect them let's we'll see what I've got to collect here oh nice 10,000 BR and now I can collect all of that so I can upgrade my text and socket another gem I've got another skill as well Might as well go for that one. Not really sure which ones I'm supposed to be going for, but we'll try that. I'll go and upgrade my mage. That's the weakest out of the three that I've got. All oh, right, I guess I just need to level up some more now. Let's see what else I unlock as I level up. By the looks of it, I'll be unlocking the guild feature at level 26. So that should be pretty good. Oh right, I've just unlocked the warehouse, as you can see here. Another building for me to upgrade. So I'll upgrade that until I have to actually wait for 
for it to upgrade. Oh, there we go. So I'll stop at that point. Also managed to get a new feature here. I can now awaken my mercenary. I think yeah, this is the strongest one. So let's try awakening this one. Here we go. So that's the stat increase from that. And an extra skill point. And some bonus items. Brilliant. So. Which one should I go for? I think I'll try that one. Confirm. There we go. So that's now level 2. Got a few more EXP scrolls to use there. I'm going to do that. All right, that's pretty good. Next thing I'll unlock is the guild. Looking forward to that. All right, I've just unlocked the guild feature now. Let's have a look at some of these guilds quickly. Okay, there's quite a lot of them. Legends. I used to have a guild called Legends. I actually made myself as an alt guild. However, I'm actually planning to make my own guild here. The same guild that I use on Wartune. Or same guild name, should I say. There we go. That's my guild. Right, how much should I contribute? Let's contribute a little bit. Because that only gives 100 wealth. You guild boss. Guild skills. 200 contribution. Guild vault. Looks a bit messed up, unfortunately. I think I can move some items there. Yeah, I need to sort out the graphics a bit on that. Guild shop. Oh, there we go. Alright, so there's my guild. If you want to join my guild, feel free to apply if you want. We can all play this game together, that'd be pretty cool. Right, it's actually getting quite hard to level up now. I've just unlocked the event dungeon, as you can see here. I'm going to give this a go. Kill monsters to get rewards. Well, why not, eh? Probably want to go with basic here. Here we go, let's start. Waves 1 out of 20. Oh wow, this could take a while. So I just gotta sit here fighting enemies until I get 20 waves done. That's gonna take a long time. No healing either, oh. Okay, this could be a problem. I think that skill heals, doesn't it? You have to keep using that. Don't think I'm going to get very far here, though. It's a cool idea, just an endurance challenge, basically. So I just need to try and keep casting heal, but as you can see, I'm almost dead already. Well, I did one wave. That wasn't wasn't good, was it? Let's be honest. What does the inspire button do? Yeah, I don't 
don't think I'm going to waste my Balans here. Alright, oh, so that's a pretty cool idea anyway. I'll give that a go when I'm a bit stronger. Alright, so this is my progress with the campaign so far. Unfortunately, it's not letting me attack the next one. I'm not really sure why. I think it's to do with the level requirement. Same with the Elite. I don't have the level to do it yet, but there are also daily dungeons. So I'm going to give a few of these a go. There's a few to choose from. Let's do the basic gold trial first. See how this goes. It doesn't look too bad. So this is hopefully possible. Yeah, looking good to win this one. That's a good skill. Oh right, there we go, we got 80,000 gold. Playing the chest as well, which is pretty good. Ordinary, so I'm going to guess that's a little bit harder. I'm going go back to simple and... Oh, okay. Only got one star on it. Try the ordinary one. See if there's any, dip any more difficult. Okay, they're definitely doing more damage. Arrow in the corner as well. I guess that takes you out of the dungeon. Well, I think I've got this one. I don't think I'd be able to do the next difficulty up though. There we go. 100,000, that's not bad. I can claim the chest. There we go. Alright, so let's try some of the other ones. Okay, so it's pretty much the same sort of thing, except hopefully different rewards. Find out in a minute. There we go. So that gives one of those green EXP scrolls and the chest. So let's try this one. Stats look pretty much the same as the previous dungeon. So hopefully I'll be able to do this one as well.
Right, there we go. That gives 40 of those. And then I'm going to guess... Oh, let's just claim the chest first. I'm going to guess this will give 40 of the redstones. I'll do this one as well, while I'm here. Oh wow, that was a big attack. Okay, that did considerable damage. I've only got three left. There we go. Alright, got 80 of those. That's pretty cool. Good way to get some extra items there. Another thing, I haven't really shown you the blitzing yet. You can only blitz dungeons that you have three stars on. I can't blitz that one, for example, because I haven't got the three stars yet. But I can go and blitz this one. I'll do it up to 30, and I'm just going to do 10. You get all of that. And that's it. That's blitzed. That was done very quickly, no waiting, no messing about. It's used the stamina and given me the items. Well, hopefully, anyway. All right, so I've just unlocked the crypt. That's like the forgotten catacombs on Wartune, I would have thought. Oh, wow, there's a necropolis as well. That's pretty cool. Imagine the catacombs is going to be the easiest one. That's some quite decent rewards as well for this. As with War Tune, you need the crypt keys to double the rewards. You can see there. I'm not going to give this a go quite yet. I'll hopefully do a full run of the crypt at some point, once I get a bit stronger though. Alright, so going back to the guild feature, we now have 19 members. I'm a little bit confused by this, I wanted to promote... It's coming up with conditions and not satisfied one. Um, I have no idea what that actually means. I think there might be a limit on the amount of officers and deputy guildmasters you can have in the guild. It's a little bit strange. There's one other feature of the guild I want to quickly show you and that's the guild boss. Now I tried this earlier and I got ripped to pieces in seconds. Just give it another go and just show you just how hard this actually is. Look at the damage. They just rip you to pieces. I managed to survive one hit. Yeah. That's what happens if you try and challenge the guild boss. You get killed very quickly. That's something for later on though, once I get a bit stronger. It looks like the bosses will get harder and harder as well, so it's going to be fun. Oh right, I've just hit level 29 and unlocked the Blacksmith Reforge. Now I'm going to guess this is the same as converting gems on War Tune. Let's give this a go now. Oh wait a sec. You can't use gold. You have to use Balans for this. I don't like that. You synthesize a higher value gem. 
Let's see how much that costs to convert. Forty. Was that the same as before? Still. I'll probably do that with the higher level gems only, or any Patak gems I get. That seems. Is that like quite a bad deal? I mean, I've got a Patak gem equipped here. Yeah, that gets more expensive. Thing is, though, Patak's useless, so I might as well try out one. Let's convert that into Patak and resocket it. Is the ring? There we go. Yeah, I was hoping you could use gold for that, but clearly you can't. So that's a little bit disappointing. It's the only feature of the game I've really been disappointed with so far, though. Overall, it's been pretty good, as you've seen. Now, I'll hit level 30 and see what unlocks there, and that'll be the end of this video, and I'll continue from there in the next video. Okay, so it's taken me quite a long time. I've just hit level 30. We have Astros available. Oh, and new ranks as well. Interesting. You get a salary. That's interesting. Right, so I need to rank up that somehow. I'm not sure how to do that yet. I'm sure, I'll work it out in time. Let's play with Astros. Here we go. Auto Astro. Oh my goodness! Don't know if I wanted to do that. Wow. Um. 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 I may have. Uh, I've overdone the Astros. Right. Politics. Why is it called politics? Right, okay, let's be a bit more careful this time. Don't press that auto astro button, let's do it slowly. Nightmare. What does that even do? Can I find out what they do? Oh, there we go. Attack. Well, that's useless then. So how do I get rid of that? Right, let's go back. Find out what... Well, that's another Patak Astral. Armour of Soul. Interesting. Let's find out what this does. Block. Right. Lifestone. Well, these are very different from the Astros on Wartune, that's for sure. What does that do? HP, right. That's probably what I want. Let's do one more Auto Astro. Oh. What well, I was able to do it a moment ago. That's very strange, right. I'm gonna have to do it the hard way. I'll probably save the rest of my gold for guild contribution. These are the ones I want, the red ones. Should be more astros than that available because there's no attack astral there. Oh, there we go. You can scroll. I only just found that out. That's the one I want. The Magic Scissors. I mean, these astral names are a little bit strange. I will be honest. I mean, they're sort of named after astrological star signs. Anyway, I'll play with that a bit more later. 
That's all I'm going to be covering in this video. As I level up, I'll go into these features hopefully a bit better. So I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching.